Good morning, Cougars. I'm Charlie. And I'm Katie, and here's the news you can use for Tuesday, February 13th. Girls Varsity lost last Friday, and speaking of losses... Don't talk to me about it. It's okay. We were so close, and then in the overtime... And and good news, three of our center Cougars made it to the Masters Wrestling Divisional last Friday. Congrats to Michael Post, Billy Lamb, and Maya Reed. Speaking of sports, are you interested in playing boys golf this spring? If so, see Coach Anderson in room 504. Sealed by literacy applications are due to the student center or Spanish teacher by February 15th. Financial Aid Nights is this Thursday from 6 to 8 in the library. Have your social security number, personal contact, and your parent slash guardian's 2022 income tax record. Multicultural Night is coming up. We are looking for students to put on cultural performances. If you're interested, contact Ms. Bowler by Friday, February 16th. Class of 2025 is hosting our talent show on February 22nd. Tickets are $5 at the door. Both cash and card are accepted. The Glow Dance tickets go on sale this week. Get yours early and save money. This Thursday and Friday, they are only $10. Next week, they go up to $12 with ASB and $15 without. On the last day of seb sales, se February 29th, the tickets are $15 for all. The dance is on March 1st from 6.30 to 9.30 p.m. Wear white or neon and leave the suits and heels at home. Come casual and be ready to dance the night away with your friends. It's time to start adding up the Moving Up rally. Oh, my God. Send your pictures and videos to ctv at centerusd.org and identify the grade level. Each class gets their own video to remember this year and seniors cover all four years. Want to be included in the yearbook? Submit your pictures to hjeshare.com and the school code is 7444. Dear Asian Youth Club is collaborating with K-Pop Club for the Lunar New Year Festival on February 16th. Come and check out the games, food, and performances. BSU is hosting a Black History Month Family Feud event on February 23rd at 6 p.m. See flyers around campus for more information. Today is the last day to get your Teddy Grahams at both lunches. They will be delivered to recipients first and second periods tomorrow. If your special someone does not receive their Teddy by second period, please stop by 106 to see Mrs. Sinwald. There are a handful for which the recipient's name is illegible or we were unable to locate that person with the name provided. It's time for another 2 plus 2 Tuesday. Work the problem to the end and make sure that your answer is in the right form. I've been there. Make sure you know the difference between standard and interval form especially. And then please tell me because I have no clue. All right. Now here's a feature from CTV's Brewer. For today's lunch rush, we're going to be doing trivia where all the answers are with E. And let's hope people actually know what they are and not just guess random things like last time. Which country in Asia is well known for its ancient pyramids? Europe. Or no, wait, Egypt. Egypt. Yeah, Asia. What is the mascot of Philadelphia's NFL team? The mascot. The team named the mascot. The eagle? Mm -hmm. The eagle. What is, what is the term used for one billion years? Can I find a friend? Yeah. Uh, Eon. Yeah, there you go, Eon. So, extraterrestrial. But <laughs> that should have been one. I'm sorry. No, okay. What is it? <laughs> what holiday is religiously celebrated for the rebirth of, of Jesus? What? What holiday? Easter. Is, yeah. What is the rare natural phenomenon where the moon covers up the sun? Eclipse. What is the largest country in, in the United Kingdom? Largest? Yeah. Europe. <laughs> England? Yeah, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> Your name, how spell it? Spell it? Yeah. B I. E. What does the E in email stand for? Email? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> what holiday is religiously celebrated for Easter. the rebirth of. Okay. Easter. <laughs> I know the bunny. What is the. <laughs> What does the E in PEMDAS stand for? <laughs> Everyone has to go over it in their head. It's because the E ain't, ain't something I use a lot. It's, I have no idea. I Exponents. Can't. 
I couldn't for the life of me figure out the largest country in the United Kingdom. I genuinely thought it was Europe for a moment. Really? It wasn't that hard. Well, yeah, yeah, fine, whatever. Anyways, we have some birthdays to celebrate today. Our counselor, Ms. Perez's birthday was yesterday, and Mr. Anderson's birthday is today. Happy birthday to you two. That's it for today, Cougars. I'm Katie. And I'm Charlie. Thanks for watching CTV.